Hi there, this is Craig Beck, the stop drinking expert. Welcome to today's video blog uh, on alcohol poisoning. What is it? How does it happen? When does it happen? And what to do if you're with someone who's got alcohol poisoning? Uh, the first thing about about this scenario is that we have 50,000 people a year in the United Kingdom admitted to hospital with alcohol poisoning. Uh, but we think of that as, a, as an unusual event. It's a strange thing. There's these weak-willed people who drink too much. But what we keep forgetting, and the brainwashing is so intense around alcohol, that is alcohol is not a social pleasantry like we tell, tell everyone. It is a poison. If you go to a chemical supplier and you buy alcohol, it will come in a container with skull and crossbones on. So the fact that you get poisoned after consuming it shouldn't be a surprise, but it is to people. It's like, oh, they must have had a, a bad batch of alcohol. So how do you know you've got it? Well, you see, alcohol is a very deceptive, very insidious drug because you have to force yourself to get addicted to it. You know it's a poison. Your body recognizes it as a poison. The first time you taste it, that becomes obvious. It tastes disgusting, and your body says to you, this is a poison, don't do this anymore. And so you have to ignore that and continue drinking in spite of what your body's telling you. And even then, when you become addicted to it, your body processes it as a poison. The liver goes into overtime trying to get it out of your system. If it gets to the point where it's losing ground and it's not getting the poison out of your system quick enough, it's going to make you throw up. It's going to invoke that natural response of the body in dealing with a poison. It's going to make you vomit because it wants it out of your body. This should be a clear sign that what you're eating is exceptionally, well, sorry, what you're drinking is exceptionally bad for you. But still, we carry on. And if you carry on after this point, it's going to knock you out. Your body, your subconscious is going to say, okay, enough, enough. I need every ounce of energy. I need all your runtime to deal with this problem. So it switches you off and knocks you unconscious. So what do you do if you've got someone who's got alcohol poisoning? You get them to a hospital. Don't take any chances. Remember that alcohol is a diuretic, so it's stripped all the moisture out of your body. So they, these people need to be on a saline drip, almost certainly, and they need to be monitored. 50,000 people a year end up in hospital because of drinking too much. Two and a half million people around the world die as an indirect or direct result of alcohol. This is a serious heavy-duty drug that we have all been brainwashed to believe as a social pleasantry and nothing more. So uh, that's alcohol poisoning. Uh, if you're watching this as a member of my Stop Drinking Club, then use this video as more evidence of the insanity that you used to believe, the brainwashing that they got you with. Congratulations on escaping. Never go back. And thank you for watching. I'm Craig Beck from StopDrinkingExpert.com.